Thursday night's Carabao Cup semi-final second leg between Chelsea and Tottenham was very much a game of two halves. Chelsea dominated the opening 45 minutes and took a 2-0 lead 2-1 on aggregate thanks to goals from N'Golo Conte and Eden Azar. Conte broke the deadlock with a volley that squeezed between the legs of three players before Hazard's cushion finish from Pedro's cross made it 2-0. Tottenham, on the other hand, barely had a sniff. But something changed at halftime as Spurs came out of the blocks fast in the second half and scored through Fernando Llorente. Article continues below the 33-year-old, who is Tottenham's only available striker at the moment, headed past KEPA Arzabalaga from Danny Rose's pinpoint cross. Chelsea continued to create chances throughout the second 45 minutes but were unable to carve open Spurs' defence quite like they did in the first. And that saw home fans focus their frustrations on one man in particular, Ross Barkley. Barkley has yo-yoed in and out of Chelsea's team under Maurizio Sarri this season and it has to be said he hasn't impressed much. Indeed, three goals and three assists in 19 Premier League appearances isn't the best of records. But the biggest problem with his play against Tottenham was how often he played the ball sidewards or backwards. He almost looked scared to take risks. Chelsea already have a player in Jorginho who likes to keep games ticking with simple passes, so they needed Barkley to make more of an impact going forward. Here's what Chelsea fans were saying about Barkley's contribution in midfield. Barkley undoubtedly has huge potential, but as an attacking midfielder he needs to be playing less passes backwards and more forwards. Safe passes aren't going to impress Sarri, so it's down to Barkley to find the confidence to take more risks and show why he deserves to start more often.